Howdy everyone, and welcome back to the Luna Geeks Out channel. Today we are back with one of my favorite idol groups. And, and, and I think the first time I reacted to them, I said that they weren't, but they really have become one of my favorites. Ray, with their cover of the song Maburoshi, I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that correctly, by the uh, also, uh, by another idol group, uh, Poopa, who I had not heard of before this... Um, before this cover happened, but I checked out the original track. It's really good. Definitely gonna have to listen to more from the uh, from the original group. Um, but yeah, as always, the uh, link to the song is the first link down in the description. So before you go watch this reaction, head down there and check that, and then come back here and finish it. And uh, one last thing before we hop into this. I am bringing back uh, reacting to requests starting from today. Every fifth reaction will be a uh, request from someone. So those are going to happen a bit more frequently now. And um, we'll, start, we'll start picking those up again because I'm not getting through this backlog anytime soon. So um, yeah, I think that's everything I need to say going to this one. Without further ado, let's hop into it. So I'll put some good drums. Okay, so the electronics of the original a bit lower in the mix, blending in with the guitars and everything. It's a cool sound, but I do think it is a bit just too noisy almost for me. Good guitar here though, as it quiets out a bit. Great bass. You know, the, the guitar and the electronics just clash a little bit too much for me. Well, that's nice right there. It's really nice right there. Oh, hold on. Looking a little better in this section. Not sure why, but maybe it's just going on me, but... Drums in this track are fantastic. Really nice vocals right there. I don't, I don't know which movie that is, but... Great vocals from them. Nice little section right here. Guitar a little bit more muted and everything. Yeah, all right, all right. That that pretty good, pretty good. Um, and I will say before you hop into the review, the uh uh, uh the pff, the other group, um, Hoopa, they have a cover of Atmosphere. Y'all, let me know if you want me to check that one out, and I'll throw it on the list. But um, yeah, no, that that was pretty good all in all. Pretty good all. In all. I I have a few slight criticisms of it that I'll get into. Um, later on, but on the whole, I think that was a fantastic cover, good reimagining of the original, while also very much being Ray's own thing. Um, 
yeah, uh, normally at this point we'd hop into the lyrical analysis. Unfortunately, I was unable to find any uh, English lyrics of the track, so we we're skipping straight ahead to the review portion. Starting off with the vocals, I, I mean, vocals were fantastic. Vocals were fantastic. I am going to say that the vocals I liked more than the um, original song, but I will also admit that that is some heavy bias coming in because I am a big, big fan of Ray. So, of course, I'm going to think that the vocals in this one were better, you know. Um, so, that is just pure personal taste right there. Um, I don't think they're, like, objectively better or whatever. It, it boils down to what you like more. Um, I like the vocals in this one more. Um, you know, the vocals were fantastic. The vocals were fantastic. There was a bit I pointed out. I don't know which member it was, but I really liked uh, their vocals in that section. And then there was the bit where everything... Was like the guitar had mentioned had a little bit of sort of muting on it, and there's a sound like some slight distortion on the vocals. Really liked that section as well. But throughout, the vocals were fantastic in this one. The guitar, whole oh, loved that. That's always been one of my favorite elements of Ray's music, that shoegaze post-rock guitar work, and I mean, that was on display here and was fantastic, and really added an amazing additional element to the song that, um, was not present in the original. There was a little bit of guitar work in there. Um, and we did actually hear that come back with a uh, slightly different sort of guitar work in here. But they're, they, it's very different in the original. So hearing that sort of Ray guitar in here was fantastic. The bass loved that. Loved that. Uh, such a good tone. Such a good sound to it. And then the drums. Oh, you'll have to give me. I am super tired today. The, um... Drums were incredible, incredible. Great little drum fill at the beginning, just some fantastic, um, not guitar, some fantastic drum work throughout. Not a lot to say on it today, but I really, really liked it. And then finally, finally, the electronics. Loved them. I mean, they was same little tune, same, uh, very similar synth sound as well to the original song, which I think transferred over well to Ray's sound. They do use some electronics in their music from time to time. So I thought the electronics were good. But, here's where my criticism comes in. The electronics and the guitar together was too noisy. They clashed. And that really took me out of it. Where the original song is this, just this fun, kind of chill uh, song. And this one had a lot of those similarities. But the way that the electronics and the guitar, uh, during the electronic sections, blended together just did not work. It took me out of it. It made it harder to listen to. Uh, I was... They didn't complement each other well. I, I don't feel like. They they were clashing against each other and just making this sound that didn't really sound like anything unless I focused on one or other of the elements. And so that is my big criticism against the song. That's the one thing I think it does the wrong, you know? Everything else in this, fantastic. That bit right there, I really do not like all that much. So, yeah, a, a little bit negative today, uh, just on that one element. But aside from that, fantastic song. Like I said, fantastic song. Um, and I, I really hope this will go up on streaming. Um, I don't know if this is one I'll be adding to my playlist just because of that one element, but it's definitely one I'd go back and listen to some more. Just, I don't really listen to music on YouTube because you know, Spotify is a lot easier for me to search up different stuff and Get, get, you know, the play is assembled. It'll definitely a lot easier to do, do albums. And also I have Spotify Premium, so no ads is uh, very much a pleasant bonus. But, um, yeah, no. Fantastic song, all in all. Even though I do have a few um, rather significant criticisms against it. But we're doing a short reaction today. I am out of things to say on the track. So, y'all know the drill. It is time to figure out what we'll be checking out next time. It got dark fast. Um, yeah, time to figure out what we'll be checking out next time. So, let's give the wheel a spin and see what we get. I'm not sure what I'm hoping for. Uh, it'll be a few days before I get to it. This might actually be the last reaction of the year. Oh, bring me the horizon. I think that right there is... Strangers, if I'm not mistaken. I believe that's what... I, uh, I believe that's what that song is. Oh! Double check before I film it, of course. But I, I believe... Oh, that is really not great lighting. Let me switch over to this because that... Yeah, that's a little better. Um, I'll double check before... 
Ah, oh, shoot, I need to have this for- Eh, whatever, we'll- we'll just end the screen recording here. Um, it, ugh, I'm gonna sidetrack. Uh, I think that stranger's I'll double check before I film it, of course, but, um... Anyways, yeah, bring me through your eyes next time. I'm really happy about that, and then only a few more reactions until we get back to a request, which is, uh, it's been far too long since we've done one of those, so that'll be quite nice. But, I am out of things to say, so that's going to do it for the video. Thank you for watching, be sure to like if you like, subscribe if you want to see more, and comment down below with your own thoughts on the track, any feedback or criticism, or anything you want me to react to. In the description, link to the song so you can go check it out, support the artist, link to my Ray Reactions playlist, my Rock and Metal Reactions playlist, because technically this is rock, and my Japanese Music Reactions playlist, also and my Alt Idol Reactions playlist. So you can check out some similar content from me, and then links to my Discord server, Instagram, Twitter, Spotify playlist of all the songs I've reacted to, at least the ones up on Spotify, and my link tree, which has my other stuff in it, in case any of that interests y'all. Anyways, like I said, that's going to do it, so once again, thank you all for watching, and until next time, I'll be seeing ya.